what the heck is this so i happened to come across these drums and oh my god i was so shocked i have never seen drums like this with my very eyes like i've seen some of them on tv but to see them in reality this is my first time and i love the details on these drums you could see the sign the sword sign which was carved on it so this is the sika phantom form by james the champion which was made in 1992 and then this is the one next to it this is short as you can see and it is called a tumpan and the tumpan is also made by the same person in 1992 like you know how old this thing is and still looks like this which means that it was made very very well and then the next one is also on a tumpan so that one was male and this is female i can't tell how they are able to determine whether this is male or female i don't know maybe the artisan is the only one who can tell but this also a tumpan female in 1992 and you could see this the, the traditional symbols around it they are can symbols these drums are can drums so. and this is the frontal from female i know the difference between the female and the male maybe maybe the sound maybe the sound tells but i don't know how someone can actually drum on this because it's so like tall like very tall i was i could literally feel short standing by this drum so there's a sicker front of a female by james champo 1992 which was made in kumasi and look at the sankofa sign or i say sankofa symbol on the drum very detailed you can see that like the the work is neat honestly i'm not an artisan but you could see how neat the work is and then oh my god this is so beautiful to see i have never seen this before and i just thought i should share it here on social media so these are ghanian drums made in ghana yes and these are signs or symbols of our culture so